Hi, thanks for joining me. This is Angie at Chicken Scratch. This is the card we're making today. Now this is paper and ink sketches number 17 and I used most of the measurements but not all of them. So the base of the card is the four and a quarter by eight and a half. Uh, but then, and then the designer series papers four by four. But then these layers change just a tad because I use the stitch shapes framelits. Okay, so you can print both of these PDFs right from my website along with the free inspiration sheet with the picture of this project. Okay, so let's go over the supplies really quick. I'm using Sahara sand cardstock that measures eight and a half by four and a quarter. Uh, succulent garden designer series paper that measures four by four. Pear Pizzazz, this is like three by three, pool party, not pool party, soft sky, like two and three quarters by two and three quarters, and two and a half by two and a half white. Just big enough for us to cut out our squares here. So I'm going to get the Simply Scored Scoring Tool and score the base of our card at four and a quarter. I'm kind of hooked on these colors right now because I've been assembling the um, adhesive bundles and the basic tool kit bundles. So I'm, I'm a little obsessed with these colors. <laughs> I love this pack of paper. Okay, so now let's put our adhesive on the back of this and add it to our card front. Okay, now let's go ahead and stamp our image. We're using Sahara Sand ink with the Sweet Sentiment stamp set. I've got that right here. This is just one of those general purpose greetings that you can use for any occasion. I'm going to give that a second to dry and we're going to get the big shot. Now the framelits, we're using the three largest ones, so the only one we're not using is the teeny tiny one. Okay, so here's the big shot. Magnetic platform and cutting pad. We'll start out with the largest one, and that's this one. Let's see if I can get two of them, and I almost didn't cut that big enough. So I said that that was three by three. So you might want to cut it a little bit larger than three by three, maybe three and a quarter by three and a quarter. I'm going to make it work though. And then the um, soft sky one is right there. We'll save the greeting for the last one. Okay, so there's that one. And here's this one. And now we'll pick up our greeting. And I want to see exactly where this one's going to cut. So I'm just going to place it right there. Okay, so now what we want to do is um, attach the soft sky square to the pear pizzazz and then we're going to take this 3 8 inch metallic ribbon this is in our celebration catalog so we only have a few more weeks left and this will be retired officially I'm going to be sad I love this ribbon I have lots of extra rolls because I love it so much Okay, now this one I'm going to attach with a dimensional right in the middle. Just like that. And then we're just going to turn it over and add adhesive to the back. Okay, so here's my original and then here's the one we just made. Cute, aren't they? Have a great day. Thanks a lot. Bye.